Bucket. He's a 10-year-old, got an application for Tennessee walking horse papers and an application for spotted saddle horse papers. He's 15 hands. See his kind eye shot there, Jill? We got one pretty boy, pretty boy. She gonna get on and show you how good he goes, and if you can't ride him, I don't think you can ride anything. He is the closest of babysitters we ever call one here. He's a very, very non-forward horse, but he's just not a lazy horse. He'll gate when you call on him, he'll him short low. He neck reins the best, so quarter horse people will be right in the boat. The only thing you'd be missing on him would be the trot. As old as I am, I like to miss that anyway. He's got a nice gait, but he'll walk the loose rein all day long if that's what you want to do. He's more than happy to help you out with that. He goes in a group really, really well. Needs the group good. He goes out by himself. You know, there's no such thing as perfect horse, but if you're just looking for a family horse, guest horse, kid horse maybe, one that you can just chill out on, get you something to drink, and go see Mother Nature and God's trees and stuff, I don't know how in the world you can beat this horse. I really, really don't. They named him Bucket because they said every time they shook the bucket, he'd come running. He's built really nice, big stout made horse. Not so tall, just big stout made horse. Sweet. So I know I say about all of them, but all mine's gotta be sweet. They can't live here. They're be friendly, easy catch. Like people, enjoy being around people. It's the kind of horses I'm gonna keep. I'm gonna keep them there. I've got some that's got a little energy, but they still love people. right there. There you have Jill and Bucket. Oh, the obstacle course. You can one hand him or two hand him, either one. Whichever one you choose to do. They're both very nice. I think for sure what he does do, even when he's short hoping, he, do, he does it very quiet and very safe. barn. Easy as one, two, three. Show you how good it gets in now. The trainer now. See his tail. <laughs> there we go. Now you can see him. Moved a little bit over to the left. Very good. I can get back to my ponderosa. Quite then calmly, like I said. Should have been his name, baby. Let's see the sun is right in my eyes.
jail. Bucket, we'll see you at the crack. There comes Bucket and Jill, and they can go down into the creek. Show you how good a 10 year old gal can do this. We had some three year olds today that did this as well. You know, you can't beat perfection if they do it, and everything they do is right. And this puts them all in an elite group, I suppose. And they are today. They've all done really well, quiet, calm. Just what makes you proud. I kind of look at myself as a little school teacher up here. I see them doing good. It just makes me shine, too. I'm going back with loose rain. Walking back so quiet. Time to shoot him. <laughs> there you have. Jill and Bucket.